Let's go drive in Aston Martin. What's up guys, it's Dan and Atlas here with our 06 V8 Vantage. This thing is sweet. Sky is an 06, just over 60,000 miles. Uh, but this one's special because it's got a six speed manual in it. Um, beautiful color combo, low mileage, it's cool. This car is perfect for somebody who wants something fun, fast, comfortable, but not super, super showy. I mean, as you can see, it's more of a luxury than anything. I mean, you know, James Bond was the coolest dude ever. He drove one of these, that's where it's at. It's a cool car. Come find it at atlasmotorsnc.com. The first time since I've been here that we've had one of these. Yeah. Yeah. It's my first time we've had one since I've been here too, man. This I like was a wheels. 2020 um, M2 competition, Hockenheim Silver over black with the blue stitching on this one. You didn't mm. get too many interior options, but you got a choice between blue and orange, and this one has the blue in it. It is super sweet. Mm -hmm. Hockenheim Silver is kind of a, a favorite. I think you see more of these in Hockenheim than anything. Yeah. These second few years of the M2 are super special because they got the S55 instead of the N55, so it has a real M engine. Nice. A lot more power. I mean, dude, it is so much power for how small this car is. Which, granted, by older standards, this thing is huge. But this is true. It's a new car, or a small car by today's standards, for sure. Super sweet. We picked this one up out of uh, Tennessee. This one is in Tennessee pretty much its whole life. Super clean car. John just has to do a few little things in it. We put a radiator in this one. We're doing our typical coolant flush, brake mm -hmm. fluid flush, oil change that we do on every single car. Um, yeah, it's almost ready to roll. I'm, I'm excited to drive this to get state inspection today. Real, real sweet car. Whoever had it took real good care of it. Real good care of this one. Can't wait to film it. Give it yeah, everything we'll get it deserves. On this guy next week. Oh for sure. yeah, yeah. Subscribe now if you want to see some really nice shots, like we got at the Vantage, but of some M performance. Whoa. All right, let's let's see what these guys think. Hey John, yep. question of the week: yep. What is what's the best BMW interior color? M rain. Ooh, M rain. Solid choice. <laughs> yeah, it, cloth wise, definitely. So that's Sean, who's also in the middle of something. Sean, what do you think is the best BMW interior color? Medina. Medina? E36 M3 stuff? Perfect. What about you, Dan? I think cinnamon. E46 M3 cinnamon mm. is like, yeah. it's like just brown enough, yep. and just orange enough, and yep. just yellow enough. It's like yep. just right in the middle. It's perfect. I'm with you on that one. But like, also, oh, but John brought up a good point. That M rain is so good. Mm. Especially like the gray M rain. I like that on like a blue car. <sighs> yes, sir. Let's see what Dan thinks. He's the only other one we got here today. Question of the week, Dan. What is the best BMW interior color? Ooh, that's a good question. Can I say fabric? Can I say cloth? Yeah, yeah. That's what John said. Did he? M texture. M texture, E46 M3, that's good. That's solid. Jay, what about you? What do you think? Yeah, I'm going cinnamon. I'm going cinnamon with you. Looks good on some. Cinnamon's things. the best. Yes, sir. What do you guys think? Let us know in the comments. Yes, sir. What's up, guys? Dan and Atlas again. I want to show you a uh, a customer car we're working on. This is our friend Riley, who has entrusted us with this gorgeous, gorgeous '91 E34 M5. Um, very, very special cars. They only brought, you know, I think like 1,300 or something of these to the country in the in the first place. Super special car. Um, this one's even more special because it's an Alpine white on black, which is mm -hmm. kind of sort of a rare color combo. A lot of these got gray interior and the uh, really light interior, but black seats on this guy. And this is easily one of the cleanest ones I've ever seen. I've seen a lot of these at shows and stuff, and this is easily one of the nicest. Jay, one of the, one of the coolest parts of these cars too is they came, most of them came with this wheel called the M System 2. What's special about it is the faces you see here that kind of look like a jet turbine, mm -hmm. they're bolt on. So on the back, mm -hmm. you got these little Torx bits on the spokes. The, 
faces just bolt on and off. You had two options with these wheels. You either wow. had these that look like a turbine, or you had ones that, um, they're called the throwing stars. They kind of look like an M contour for those who are familiar. Um, two options, these are the rarer ones. They're kind of hit or miss. Some people like them, some people don't. I love them. I think it's one of the coolest wheels BMW's ever made. Let alone, like, I mean, they were doing this back in the 80s and 90s, too. Actual functional venting, yes. everything. Now that's pretty tight. But what do we do with this guy? We put a brand new transmission in it. So come check this out. I mean, dude, it's beautiful. Oh, yeah. That's new. That I shouldn't say it's a brand new transmission. It is a pretty much remanufactured transmission from a uh, company called Technic Garage. She's clean. Yeah, it's beautiful. I mean, look at that. Wow. Really nice CNC machined brace, custom for this car as well. But thankfully, Riley trusted us to do all this. We're, we're excited to rip it, put it through its paces on, on the test drives, you know what I'm saying? New clutch, <laughs> all that good stuff. Thank you all for watching. If you guys like what you saw, please like, comment, subscribe, and follow us. We'll catch you next time. Ah, I hate being HR director.